This is Lance Excalibur with the aficionados. What's happening, my fellow nerds? Give me pound. Oh! What up, bro? Man, I'm by myself. Now, I just binged 13 episodes of the most awesome anime that I have ever seen. Well, I'm not going to say ever seen, but it's one of the best animes that I've ever watched. Um, and that's not a no Taizai, better known as Seven Deadly Sins. This anime is fan. Fantastic. I can't even go into detail. Well, I can't go into detail. It has the battles. It has the character development. It has the battles. It has epicness in the story. And did I mention it has the battles, man? It has the battles. Oh my God. Now guys, before I go crazy, I'm going to give you a quick breakdown of what the anime is about. Pretty much, you have this kingdom that has these awesome knights called the Seven Deadly Sins. They're the greatest knights and the most legendary knights of all the knights of this kingdom. These knights were betrayed and framed by someone unknown and so the kingdom actually started hunting the knights down. The knights separated and hid their identities and so they're scattered around the world. Years later, the princess of this kingdom goes and looks for these knights. She finds Meliodas, this guy right here. Now, Meliodas is a midget. Well, maybe I shouldn't say midget. He's more like a little person. I don't want to be offensive to nobody. Come on now, you know what I'm trying to say. He's little. He's a little person. Now, Meliodas is super awesome badass, and he is also a member of the Seven Deadly Sins. And they go on a journey to find the other Seven Deadly Sins to face some super awesome evil epicness that they have to battle, and only the Seven Deadly Sins can battle them. Now, I know the anime sounds generic. I know it sounds generic, but believe me, guys, it is epic in every possible way. The battles, man. If you love Dragon Ball Z, you will love this anime, but this anime don't have all the buildup before the fights. Y'all know what I'm talking about with that buildup stuff. I mean, don't get me wrong, I love Dragon Ball Z, still my favorite anime of all time, but the buildups, man, the buildups. <laughs> first form. Don't act like y'all don't know what I'm talking about. That was annoying. As epic as Dragon Ball Z was, that was annoying. But we ain't talking about Dragon Ball Z. Not on no Taizai, aka Seven Deadly Sins. You gotta watch this anime. It is awesome. You get the adventure. You get the characters of fun. There is, it's just a good anime. You know, and they need to make, I wish they would make more animes like this. This is a really, really fun anime. The only negative thing that I can actually say about this anime is that if you're watching the manga, it really doesn't directly coincide with the manga. They are going the slightly anime only route. They are keeping, they are keeping the same storyline, but it is sped up like tremendously. And if you actually are reading the manga, you already know about the anime anyway, so it probably don't even, you know, matter to you. But for those of you guys who don't know anything about it, you gotta check it out this anime is fantastic in every possible way so comment down below guys and let me know how much you love this anime tell me how epic you know it is because if you don't think it's epic if you don't love it if you have anything negative to say in the comments about this anime everyone's entitled to their own opinion this is Lance Excalibur with the aficionados and I'm out <laughs> Let's look at your work. Your work is he, very, um, very bad. Snow White and the Huntsman. Really? I mean, bad. I want to kill myself to see that movie. Okay, but is it bad, like story? Or is it bad visually? It's so bad. A lot of it's, it, was it was bad, bad. Visually, so bad, imagine bad. that sort of.